M.R. James perfected the ghost story. After James, the traditional ghost story had nowhere else to go, which is presumably why the BBC at Christmas, when looking to film a ghost story, never look any further than M.R. James, which is a shame because other writers took the ghost story afterwards into far more interesting and psychological territory. Uh, writers like Walter Delamere, who wrote the brilliant Seaton's Aunt, uh, a very, very creepy story at the end of which you're not sure whether anything supernatural has actually happened. Uh, authors like um, Oliver Onions, who wrote The Beckoning Fair One, and L.P. Hartley. But to my mind, the author who brought the ghost story up to date made it relevant to the 20th century and the 21st century, it was Robert Aikman. He took the ghost story into almost entirely psychological territory. Our perception of the supernatural is processed through our own minds, and our minds are far more scary and strange and weird and wonderful than the old-fashioned ghost. Aikman's first collection, We of the Dark, was written with Elizabeth Jane Howard. Together, they created what Aikman called the strange story, as I say, the more modern version of the old-fashioned ghost story, and they're absolutely wonderful. The strange thing is that Elizabeth Jane Howard never went into the same territory again, but Robert Aikman continued to write short stories of an incredibly high calibre um, and very, very strange stories for the rest of his life.